Hey guys, welcome back to a new video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to actually get the most trials tokens possible. It's going to be an easy way to farm them. Now, in my inventory I've been playing for a little while and I do actually have quite a few. So I'm going to be making a video, I think Tuesday on Reset, where I do actually open all these tokens. I've got 394 so far. So I should get around about 500 for that video. So make sure you subscribe, turn on post notifications for that. But in today's video, like I said, I'm going to show you how to do it. So pretty much we're going to head on over to Saint 14. Now anyone can do this method. It's really not that hard. So obviously you've got your weekly bounties and your daily bounties. Make sure you do all of these every day. Because obviously you're going to get tokens for that as you can see too. Not only that, another way to do it is to purchase these every single time. You can pretty much get unlimited amount of bounties from him, but it does cost a lot of glimmer. So take that into mind, but you're going to want to be doing that. Now, one of the easiest ways and the one anyone can do is simply get a passage. So it doesn't matter anyone, just get a passage. Now, if you do have five wins on your card, I do believe you can pick up the third one. Now the third one is really handy and it's the one you should use. If you're a decent player and you've unlocked it, you will have this. So it increased tokens from completing and winning trials matches. Now this is really handy. It's probably one of the most useful things to actually farm tokens in the game at the minute. And it's a current card that I am using. So pretty much if you've got a team, you'll be able to do this. But a lot of people have started to do this on the forums and that. So all you need to do is your bounties. Now Passage of Wealth is a good one. Because as you can tell it gives you extra tokens. But all you need to do guys. Is simply play one match and reset. Now by doing this. You're going to match worse opponents. You're not really going to match anyone that's decent. Unless you do actually find a team starting up a fresh card. But all you have to do is get a win and reset. And after every win you will get 5 tokens with this Passage. Now, a lot of people have said play three games and then reset and they're wrong. You shouldn't do that because you are going to be matching better opponents each game you do actually go up. So, say if you're in your second game, you're going to be playing people that have won the first game. Whereas if you reset after your first game, you'll be back to square root. So, no one's really going to be playing that good. And anyone can do this. Even if you lost 20 games with a standard passage, you'll actually get some gear because it takes 20 trials tokens to actually get a piece of armor or weapon so if you do have the passage of wealth and you lose 10 games i do believe you can get trials tokens enough to get something from the vendor so that is the fastest way to do it hopefully you guys did enjoy this video i know it was quick it's pretty much just a quick guide telling you how to do it before reset because there's only like today and tomorrow to do it Hopefully this video goes out Monday, but if it doesn't, take it into next week and actually use it then. That's pretty much it. Like I said in my previous video, I'm going to start to stream on Twitch. I know I said I'd do it this week, but I've been setting everything up. So if you do want to follow my Twitch, it's going to be in the description of today's video at the top. Drop it a follow and hopefully next week we will be doing some carries through trials. And as always guys, I'll catch you in the next one.